I've been trying to do my eyes first when I do my makeup applications. So that's what I'm gonna start off with. Did apply some moisturizer to my skin and that's what I'll be using as my base. This eyeshadow palette has 21 eyeshadows. They're a mix of shimmers, satins, and matte in this palette. They're just all the fall vibes that I'm looking for, even though we're pretty much in winter. This does not come with a mirror. If you're looking for that, this palette doesn't have it. And you can get it on Carity's website for $19.99, I believe. So I'm just gonna take this little fluffy brush from Laura Mercier. I am loving the eye brushes a lot. And I'm gonna dip into the color, let's do Dune. It's like this yellowy shade. I'm just gonna use this as a base color. Can't really see that color on my lids, but that's a first because usually it becomes ashy or too dark too fast. So this is a good color um, to start off as a transition. This is building up. I'm starting to see it now, so that's nice. I love eyeshadows that you can build up. I'm usually always in a hurry, so I just like to slap my eyeshadows on. The Rosé All Day palette is the same formula. It blends amazing. I could just wear that alone and be good. That's pretty, that's pretty. Ooh, that's pretty. I'm gonna pick up Harvest, which is a deeper orange, and I'm just building up that color. Ooh. Let's put this all in the crease. I'm switching brushes. I'm using this Juno & Co ES06 brush. These are really good brushes as well. I'm gonna pick up Sunrise. It's a glitter shade. Whoa, that's amazing. I'm just gonna pack this on and see what it does. Oh, that's like a pretty, it's very complimentary. I'm not going to wet my brush or foil. I usually don't foil unless I'm looking for a glittery look but we're gonna keep this just the way it is with the other side of that brush I'm going to pick up embers which is like a yellow it's definitely a brighter yellow like a neon style yellow I'm just gonna put that in the inner corner. With that Laura Mercier blending brush, we're just gonna blend out. And I'm gonna deepen the outer corner a little bit. So I'm going to pick up, let's pick up Spicy. I find that if you pat, you get more of the color if you kind of blend with a windshield wiper motion, it disperses the product a little more. So I would like to pat to build up that shade. Okay, I like the way it looks when I use my fingers. If you're trying to get them to look the way they look in the palette, use your fingers. I'm just gonna go back and forth and pick up spicy in the outer corner again. I'm bringing it into that inner corner. And a little mascara. Okay, so I'm back from applying my foundation routine. I have a video I filmed separately for that. So if it's not already up, I will link it. But um, I'm just going to fix this area with whatever's left from that eyeshadow. I'm just using that spicy shade. The spicy shade is just 
gonna go all the way around. I want it to connect. I don't want a sharp line. I just kind of want to buff that color out a little bit. I'm gonna pick up Harvest and go under the lash line one more time. Now you can go in with eyeliner. I actually personally just like it like this, so I'm just gonna keep it this way, but I think that it is so pretty. Oh, I love it. I want the eyes to be the focus of this look, so I'm just gonna keep my lips pretty neutral and I'm gonna use Laura Mercier's Velour Extreme Matte Lipstick and Vibe. And then I'm gonna top it off with NYX's Butter Gloss in Praline. Praline? 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 So before I apply the lip color, I'm just going to take off the foundation from my lips. I love using the Micellar Cleansing Water from Garnier. This is a really good cleansing water. I personally really, really like this palette. I felt like the eyeshadows were very smooth. I really like the colors. I love that they are a mix of shimmer satins and mattes, and the mattes are very creamy. I don't really care about fallout. I know like in the past, we've all talked about, there's fallout, there's fallout. I mean, it performs on the eye really amazing. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much to Carity for making really good products. And if you wanna get it yourself, I will have links down below as well as all the other products that I used in this eye tutorial. Thanks so much for taking time to watch. Thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you in my next video.